Alrighty folks, we are back here in Medina, actually right next to the Harley dealership I was at, Thrill Point Motorsports here, for Kawasaki demo days this time. I'm going to start off on the Versus 650, just sitting on the Versus 62, 280. Very easy to flat foot, as you can see I got the good bent knees. I'm liking that TFT, that thing is pretty. Gives you just what you need, fuel gauge, tack, speedometer, neutral indicator, and it looks like, let's see... Oh yeah, gear indicator as well, that's nice. So the Versus 650 is going to have everything you need. Nice little windshield, we'll see how well that works. Oh, that friction point is right at the end. That was a little touchy on this thing. Feels real comfy setting off though. And once you get into the throttle, it's pretty smooth. Yeah, the throttle's just a little twitchy. I mean, I like that immediate throttle response, but it's hitting as soon as you touch it for sure. But like I said, once you actually get going, it's actually fairly smooth. I like how the 650 sounds, man. This bike is very comfortable off rip these adventure bikes man they definitely do it for me get a little bit of sportiness a little bit of off-roadiness and here we go my buddy is taking his time right here dog what are we doing i mean look how far we are from the people up ahead <laughs> goodness that's kind of crazy my man i'm scared to hit the throttle or something front brake bites nicely I don't know what's going on with this guy right here. I don't know if he's scared of the Z900 or what, but he needs to speed it up a little bit. Initial impressions, though, this thing feels nice, man. Throttle's a little bit, little bit twitchy, but nothing crazy. I need this dude to use some of that power on that 900 because we're just getting left behind. We're not allowed to pass people on these rides, so I can't just go catch up with the people ahead. Mirrors look plenty useful, take up a good bit of space. He said it's going to be about a 20 minute, 25 minute ride, so we should get a uh, good bit of use out of this 650, man, this Versus 650. And I've been uh, looking forward to getting a chance to ride some of these Kawasaki's for a while, especially this one. Uh, people seem to love it. This bike feels good, though, man. Power comes on smooth. It's got enough torque down low to get you going, even up in third and fourth gear. Oh, shit. Come up here. Okay. Him. Okay. okay. That's actually beautiful. They just let me go ahead in front of this guy since he's fucking up the group. Got the adjustable gear, gear lever, and brake lever. That's nice. This bike's got everything you need, man. Solid beginner bike, something that you can, uh, that shouldn't be too crazy on power, but you'll be able to grow into and have a lot of fun with. Now we can actually get some speed going since Buddy on that Z900 was acting soft. Yeah, that's smooth, man. All the way through, it's just smooth. Try to get these tires warmed up a little bit. Yeah, I like the way this thing feels a lot. Comfy, rides good, leans over nicely. Makes nice little sound. Even in first gear, the power is not too much out of this 650. It's just so smooth all the way through the power band. I mean, she definitely doesn't lean back and forth as easily as uh, some bikes I've ridden, but no complaints. I mean, still fairly easy to get her tossed around. Just a little bit more pressure. I really like the dash on this thing, man. It's super clean and clear. Got all the information you need and really nothing more than that. Yeah, it's a little windy today. Feels good though, man. Perfect weather for a ride. Hopefully it doesn't rain because there is a little in the forecast, but looks like we're good for now. Yeah, man, the Versus 650. I've uh, I've been real interested in this bike, and it does not disappoint. I'm uh, definitely a fan of this Kawasaki 650. Like I said, the riding position is super comfortable. At 6'2", 280, I don't feel cramped or anything. My legs are tucked under me just perfectly. I could definitely see myself riding something like this all day. And it's just got plenty of power without being too much. Yeah, I, I am a big fan of this 650. That feels nice. That feels real nice. The throttle could just be a little more smooth. I, I'm a fan of immediate throttle response, but it could be a little smoother, and I wouldn't be mad about that. Just a slight bit twitchy when you're first taking off, but... Once you get going, it's not too bad. Yeah, man, this thing is comfy, feels good. Slight bit buzzy at certain RPMs, but it's not. 
it's not like it's not bad like i don't think my hands are going to be numb after this ride small bump right there didn't feel like much of anything at all seat on this thing is pretty comfy can stand up on it nicely yeah rolling into that power in fourth gear about 4000 rpm it, it just goes plenty of power to have fun with i can definitely see why experienced riders love this thing and i'll tell you what medina is a nice area to ride through i'm glad we got a much wrong much longer ride this time than uh than we did at the harley demo days because that was only about a 10 minute ride there rear brake bites nice not too hard front brake is it's there i mean it's grabbing as soon as you as soon as you touch it for sure Yeah, she's got plenty of power to have fun with. I like that a lot. It's so smooth the way it delivers it. Even in first gear, it doesn't feel like the torque is gonna throw you off the back of the bike at all. Nice and planted in the seat. Pretty easy to, ooh, okay. Got some cool stuff there. Pretty easy to uh, rev match on downshifts. Oh yeah, those brakes will get you, get you slowed down real nicely. at the top of third gear is not bad out of the little 650 man and it's so smooth too you really don't even feel the speed to be honest oh yeah she'll she'll flick nice and nice and easily essentially at freeway speeds this thing feels plenty stable man feels real good around 70 miles per hour that windshield seems to be doing a good amount of work to get the wind up over me i definitely feel the wind smacking me but it's nothing crazy at all i feel plenty stable and sturdy on this thing roll into it you got all the passing power you need in six gear this is definitely something i could see myself riding very enjoyable ride on the old versus 650. the only thing that i would say about this bike as far as beginner rideability is the throttle can be a little bit twitchy so you got to be smooth on the throttle and the clutch but i mean it's really not bad at all like i said once you actually get going it's pretty smooth this thing is comfy you can ride it at highway speeds probably take it on some light off road trails especially if you get some knobby tires yeah i'm getting a little bobblehead right now just a little bit oh yeah you tuck your head down and just get tucked in here real good under that windshield you're good that's smooth but i mean even even without doing that it feels good you just got to be willing to deal with some of those uh some of those highway speed wind bashings but that goes for pretty much everything if you don't have nice big fairing slash windshield stuff like that on the front i like the way this bike sounds when it revs out man yeah man highly recommend checking out the versus 650 if it's a bike that you're interested in this thing is it's nice rides beautifully very easy to ride except for the uh twitchy throttle off the takeoff man this thing is smooth the power delivery is extremely smooth all the way through as you saw even even in those first gear pulls it's it's absolutely nothing and it's so smooth i mean don't get me wrong you could get yourself in a little bit of trouble with it because it's got enough power to get you uh get you going pretty fast but yeah, the power is not too much at all for a new rider. This is something I could definitely see myself buying. That sounds so good. I love that. Not the best P twin sound. Don't get me wrong, but it sounds good. I'm here for all the uh, all the motorcycle sounds. All right, folk. We got the end of the ride on the Versus 650. We'll go ahead and put this back. And get signed up for another one. But yeah, folks. Go ahead and check out the versus 650 future local kawasaki demo days ride one of those see if you can test ride one at the dealership or something man that's a good little bike appreciate y'all watching man have a good one